वेलकम बैक टू मेरी क्लास अगली डकलिन स्टेज द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ ऑक्लूजन इज डिवाइडेड इन टू फोर पार्ट द फर्स्ट पार्ट इज द प्री प्राइमरी पीरियड वेर इन द बेबीज डो नॉट हैव टीथ एंड हैव गम पैथ इनिशियली द सेकेंड फेज इज अ प्राइमरी डेंटिशन पीरियड वेर इन द किड्स हैव मिल्क टीथ द मिक्स डेंटिशन पीरियड इज अ पीरियड वेन द मिल्क टीथ स्टार्ट टू फॉलो ऑफ and the primary dentition are seen the last phase is a permanent dentition period wherein all the permanent teeth are seen what is ugly duckling stage ugly duckling stage in the mixed dentition phase is a physiological space that is the midline diastema this was first described by broadben in 1941 hence it is called as broadben's phenomena let's see the characteristics The ugly duckling stage is seen between 8 to 12 years of age. Normally, the physiologic space that's the midline diastema is around 2 mm. This is also called as self-correcting malocclusion. This is the midline diastema. Now let's see what all happens in ugly duckling stage. The developing permanent canines, especially the maxillary canines, often cause the mesial displacement of the roots of permanent incisors up to the age of 8 to 12 years. So these are the canines that start to push the roots of the incisors mesially. This causes a distal divergence of the crown of these incisors. Permanent incisors thus appear to be much larger as compared to the primary teeth with the longitudinal axis flared out like inverse V shape. So this is the inverse V shape and canines cause distal divergence of the crown of the incisors as they erupt more further. After the canines erupt completely all the incisors return into normal alignment that is called as self correcting malocclusion clinical considerations when the diastema is more than 2 mm a pathologic condition like mesiodens or intrabony lesion may exist this may require a proper investigation like x-rays No orthodontic treatment should be attempted at this stage as there is a danger of deflecting normal eruption path of the canine. It is a self-correcting malocclusion hence no orthodontic treatment should be attempted. Why is the stage called as the ugly duckling stage? This stage indicates an aesthetic appearance of the child between 8 to 12 years hence it is called as an ugly duckling stage. To summarize Ugly duckling stage is a physiological space between maxillary incisors also called as midline diastema. This stage is seen in mixed dentition period. This was first described by Broadben in 1941. This is also called as self-correcting malocclusion. And we have seen clinical consideration for ugly duckling stage. You can find the link to the MCQs for this topic in the description of this video. Thank you for watching the video. We hope you liked it. And if you did, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell for updates regarding our new videos. See you in the next video. Till then, stay healthy and have an amazing week.